Hello viewers, please be upon you and welcome to another video. Today in this video, I'm I'm gonna show you how to calculate potential evapotranspiration with drink software. So for this, uh, you need a drink software installed in your PC or laptop. And I have already showed you how to calculate uh, or how to prepare the uh, dataset to calculate SPI and potential evapotranspiration. So let's start. Uh, first of all, yeah, you have to uh, you have to click here the data management. Then you have to browse the uh, location of your data of precipitation. Uh, this one, the precipitation. Okay, and uh, we don't have a PET file, and we want to calculate the potential evapotranspiration. Uh, so that's why uh, here you can uh, see the first year is 1961 because my uh, data is from 1961 and uh, till 2018 that's why 58 years uh, I have already uh, typed here 1961 to 58 if your uh, data is starts from 1980 so you have to uh, type here 1980 and uh, till how many years then you can uh, write here years uh, 30 20 25 like that okay and uh, now you have to calculate uh, you have to you have to uh, click here PET calculate PET okay then you will see a pop-up window like that uh, here you uh, you see a auto detect I am uh, going to deselect it okay first year 1961 61 years 58 years and uh, I want her grips method and the latitude is 23 degree and 43 minutes okay and uh, now you have to input here maximum temperature and minimum temperature so click here browse maximum temperature then browse minimum temperature okay uh, here you see you need a minimum mean temperature or average temperature uh, if you don't uh, select it calculate mean temperature as the max plus t mean divided by 2 if you don't uh, select it then you have to insert here a mean temperature uh, data uh, i am i am selecting here calculate the mean temperature as t max plus t mean divided by 2 okay if i click here then i no, uh, don't need to in, uh, input a mean temperature here okay now uh, how uh, what name or uh, uh, in where in which location you want to see the output file you have to browse it i want it here like as p e t dot x l s x okay i uh, want to see my output file as p e t dot x l s x okay then click open then uh, here you see open file after calculation I want to see uh, what is calculated so let's click here select it and now calculate calculation is processing okay our calculation is already done and we are gonna show we are gonna see what we have calculated okay guys here you can see the uh, estimated potential evapotranspiration millimeter per month our grips method location latitude 23 degree 43 minutes okay uh, these are the years these are the years and uh, these are the uh, months and these are the these are the 
potential evapotranspiration monthly and this is for annual annual potential evapotranspiration so i hope you enjoyed the video and if this video is uh, helpful to you then please uh, like comment and share my video and subscribe and do subscribe my channel and i will uh, show you how to calculate spi in the next video thank you